guys this is a catch-up session for those who are behind with office data processing level two so guys we are going to talk about creating a file a folder and a subfolder now number one we need to understand when we are talking about a file what are we talking about before everything guys when you open your when you switch on your computer guys you are having this this is a desktop guys so i'm going to create a folder in this desktop and save the file now number one when we are talking about a file we are talking about a single document that you are working in i get it. we opened here now we are having a blank page that we are working in but after working in this page what are we going to do at the end of the day we need to save this work some way now that is where the folder comes into place now when we are talking about a folder guys a folder it's a container that is used to store data or information in the computer now how do we create a folder we right click here then we go to new i'm sorry if my screen is not visible new then we create a a folder now we need to rename this folder that we just created here we click on it left click then right click then we go to rename then i'm going to rename it using my surname which is hallway here now i'm having a folder hallway here now guys let's go back to our file i get we are working on this a file doing whatever speed test or whatever that needs to be done how are you going to save this file you go to file save as now where is that file the folder that i have created i have created that folder in the desktop so when you click the desktop you are going to see different folders that are on the desktop here then we double click this hallway then we need to rename our our file we can rename it i'll use days of the week for an example monday then what do we do we save now we can peacefully close here but again another method we can go to your i'm sorry guys i'm sorry for 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 this we can also again go to our folder hallway then under whole we are having a file named monday i get it guys i can another way of creating another file we can right click again new and then we go to microsoft document then we are having a file and uh, we can rename it immediately by clicking taking in tuesday for an example here now i'm having a file for monday as well as tuesday i can open tuesday and work on it then what do i do i save ensure that you always save your work before leaving another system of saving is that you can just click on this save a uh, 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 button here or you can continue working because we have already created the file inside the folder when you close here it is going to give you a dialogue saying do you want to save the changes that you have made then you click save now we can create another again a file that we can use then wednesday we can rename it to wednesday uh, sorry about that we can rename it wednesday so that is how we create the files you can work on your file and save it under a certain folder here now we have what we call the subfolder what are we talking about when we are talking about the subfolder now the subfolder is a file inside the file here is the container hallway now we can create a new folder again with the system that we are used to or again 
here if you can see this new folder here now folder number one we can rename it to week one and another folder to renaming it again to week two now what am i saying i'm saying for this monday we can just choose to take this information to week one tuesday you right click you drag again to week one wednesday again you click you drag to week one so it means you can open week one we are going to get all the work that we have done to week one or we can go back again to home here for week two there's nothing you can create other files inside the folder number two so that is what we are talking about guys when you are talking about the files and the folders as well as the subfolders again summary i'm saying uh, this one it's a, a folder now inside the folder we can double click we open the folder we are having the subfolders why do i call this the subfolder because it is a what a folder inside a folder so we call this the subfolders inside the subfolders we can have different files it we can also create different folders inside this folder as long as you can arrange your work nicely uh, let me sh lastly let me show you how to delete a file or a folder again we can come here right click then we delete what are we deleting here we are deleting a file if we go to hover here we have a folder for week one and week two now if we want to cre delete let's say again week one we go here right click again delete now because there's information here you are going to get a communique again that are you sure you want to send this folder to the recycling bin then you click yes so this is how we create folders this is how we delete folders this is how we create we can also create another folder here and rename it again when we rename it, we can rename it again to week month to week, week one. So this is how we do it, guys. I hope this session was informative. I'm just going to keep them short, less than 10 minutes all the time so that we can all of us be on the same pace. We can always be able to uh, practice at home. So I'm going to add on these videos on a weekly basis so that we can do something while we are at home and you can always refer if there's something that you don't understand. Please subscribe. Also click the sharp uh, if the video you liked it. If not, again, you can comment on where I can improve. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy the rest of your day.